What's up guys? Welcome, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Davia. If you're new to my channel, my voice sounds kind of cracked right now. But I don't know. Anywho, it is officially Daytober, and I'm pretty sure you're probably like, what is Daytober? So Daytober is all month of October. You're gonna be coming with me and Lanai doing all the fall activities, just doing home stuff, doing outside stuff, picking our first pumpkin, doing some home decor, which we're actually gonna do today. But yes, it's just gonna be a full of just so many activities. I am not gonna be vlogging every single day, but we will be having fun, we will be going outside, we will be going to farms, we will be going to our first haunted house. Like, I have never been to a haunted house and I've been alive for, what, 27 years? I don't know where I've been. Even, like, when I was living in Massachusetts, I used to live next to Six Flags, like, probably, like, 15 minutes down the road from my house. And I have never went. Like, never. Rosie, what are you crying for, girl? What, what is you crying for? What's the matter? What's the matter? Hmm? What's the matter? Hmm? What's the matter with you guys? Why are you whining? You hear somebody? You see, you're always getting so big. They need haircuts. So bad. <laughs> but yeah, anywho. So yeah, I, I used to live near Six Flags and I never went to like their spooky thing that they used to have. And I'm just like, what the heck? It's so weird. Like, how haven't I ever been to a haunted house? But guess what? This year is going to be the year because I've always talked about it. And I don't do scary. Like, I'm a punk. <laughs> so, I don't like anything scary. I don't even like scary movies. But, I want to try it. And I want to go. And Lenai said she wants to go. So, we're going to do it. So, I'm excited for that. It's going to be fun. It's going to be a good time. But, we just got back from Hobby Lobby and Burlington Co. Factory and all those good stuff to get some home decor for the house. And then, we just got done eating our Chick-fil-A. Anywho, my face has also been breaking out. I don't know if you guys can tell. But, I've been trying to take my vitamins lately. And... It just been breaking my skin out and I'm the kind of person, I don't like pimples, so I will pick at it and it's so bad because I know that I'm not supposed to pick at them, but I can't help myself. <laughs> and I'm trying to get better. I've been trying to do like toothpaste. I also brought um, this new skincare product called Order the Ordinary and so I'm going to be trying, been trying that, but I'm going to stop my vitamins for right now so I can find something better because I don't know which vitamin it is that's actually breaking me out. So, yeah, story of my life. But anywho, let's go ahead and see what we brought. I have my hair and my face and my nose. And ugh. also, I want to show you guys something. So I don't know if any of you guys have this, but you see that freaking bug on my ceiling, right? So there's these things called, um, they're called silverfish. And I've been seeing them lately. And I'm not a happy camper. And so... I called the pest control. He just said, oh, it's just normal because it's just moisture. And I live right above the attic and so all this other stuff. But I'm just like, I'm not here for it. So what can we do? He's like, he puts some spray down. But I feel like when pest control comes to your house and puts spray down or whatever they be putting, it just brings all the bugs out. I don't do bugs, y'all. Like, I'd be really upset when I see these bugs. Because, like, right now i got to grab me some bleach. And spray it even though somebody who's watching this video right now tells me don't spray the bugs don't spray the bugs just grab a shoe I'm not about to be smashing no bug with a shoe because what if it falls and get on me or even though when I spray it do fall but it don't get on me I know where it goes so guess what BAM I'm about to spray it I'm about to spray it today <laughs> And I know, he said, don't use bleach, it's gonna get your carpet stuff, but guess what? You're about to die. Die, buddy, buddy, buddy. Die, buddy, 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 buddy. Go, 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 go. Go! It's not reaching him. I don't have no more bleach. I don't have no more bleach, guys. My bleach is running out. No. <laughs> My bleach is running out, so I'm about to try something else. Um, I don't know what I'm going to do. <sighs> okay, I don't even have, like, it's crazy how I don't like bugs, but I don't have no bug spray. Yeah, story of my life. So, we're going to have to, we're going to have to figure it out, honey, because 
<laughs> this bug got to go. Maybe I can just smash. I don't want to smash it though. I'm over here talking to myself like I ain't got no damn sense. But I'm gonna just use stainless steel. <laughs> Cause he has to go. He's on my ceiling. Ah. Okay. I think he sees me. About to kill him. So he's trying to act like he invisible. But you're not. But you're not. Okay, so it's dead. But I just realized the reason why I spray it is because they have like these. I don't even know, like their body is made of like, ugh, I have to look it up, I forgot what it's called. But their body is made of like these little tiny, tiny testicle things. And when you spray it, it soaks it up and so it automatically dies. And so, that's why. But now, I have to freaking take it off my wall because it doesn't fall. <laughs> but it's dead, so that's all that matters because I don't do bugs. <laughs> I don't do bugs. So now that that is done, it is time to tuck Lanai in bed first because she has school tomorrow. So I'm gonna go ahead and put her to bed and then I can show you guys what I brought today for fall. Saw nothing. Here she goes. Good night, my love. Good night. I will talk to you and see you tomorrow. <laughs> okay, so now that the bug is dead and Lanai is tucked in bed, I still have to wipe her off the wall, but we're gonna do that later. Anywho, now I can show you guys what I brought from the store today. So now I can show you guys what we got. So I had gotten this candle right here. And it's a pumpkin butter. And it smells absolutely amazing. Like, ugh, I just can't wait for my house to just smell like fall. Because it's like the most happiest time besides Christmas. It's the second most happiest time for me, even though it comes before Christmas. But... Y'all know Christmas, I go all out. So, I'm excited for that season too. And then I had gotten another one. It's called Pumpkin Pie and Cinnamon. I got these also from Burlington Co. Factory. And then I had got another one. These are actually all from the same company, it looks like. Um, no, this one's not, but the last two are. But this one is called, called White Pumpkin and Vanilla. Cute little, same little bottles. But this one... It reminds me of, I don't know if you guys ever been to Yankee Candle, but if you go into Yankee Candle during the fall time, this is exactly what Yankee Candle smells like. It just brings back so many memories. But I also went to Walmart. I just got my nail. Went to Walmart and I got a little pumpkin. So I had gotten, I don't know if the lighting is pretty bright, but I got this little pumpkin. It was five bucks, well, six dollars. And then I got. Lanaya shower cleaner for her bathroom. Then I got this little sign that says Hello Pumpkin. And then I have got <clears throat> another one. This one just says Welcome Home. And this was what? Eight dollars? Yeah, this was eight dollars at Walmart. I don't really I don't really shop at Walmart for home decor, but they have some pretty good prices because I had also gotten some of these. This little um straw beds and what is it called it's not straw beds it's straw bales bale whatever it's called but um i had one to hobby lobby and these were like 14 dollars and this is at walmart for 6.97 so happy i didn't buy it at hobby lobby because i went there first and then i had got some of these little these little fall kitchen napkins well kitchen decor towels and then I had also I'm gonna be reusing these pillows I'm not sure if you guys remember from last year I had gotten these pillows last year so I'm actually gonna reuse these on my couch and I have a set of those but I have a set of two and so I have that one and I have this one and in the back it looks like this so I'm gonna be reusing those I take those out the storage and then I also went to Burlington and just got the spoon holder um, this was what $2.99 this one just said be grateful and give thanks and then I had also got this pillow. I had gotten this from Marshalls. And it just says, welcome to our pumpkin patch. I think this is super cute and it's on both sides. So it's versatile and you can kind of do whatever you want with it. And then I had got this little sign as well. This was $6.99 at Hobby Lobby. And then what else did we get? 
we had got this blanket this blanket actually we didn't get it this was from last year too and so i pulled this little blanket out that i had from last year and let me throw that on the sofa as well and that was really it i had gotten some other pumpkins but i already opened it because i wanted to see how big they were because you couldn't see on the inside of the package so i opened those those are over there but yeah that's really it i'm so excited i love when i just redecorate my house because everything just feels like a whole new energy and so i'm excited i'm excited to light my candles mm. It's going to be a good time. So if you guys are staying around for Daytober, make sure you guys let me know in the comment section what you guys like to do during fall because Mila and I are literally about to try every single thing that we never have done or even if we've done it before, we're going to do it again. And so if you guys have done something or like your favorite things to bake or comfort food or whatever it is let us know so that we can try it and we can experience one of your guys favorite things because we may not think of everything so let us know but rather than that that is it for this video i'm going to show you guys what i do with all this stuff in a little clip at the end but rather than that it's day over and i'm excited so i hope that you guys are excited and i'll see you guys in my next video Bye.